final notice to Lara Croft, a current tenant of premises. This is to serve as your final notice for the purposes of terminating your ownership of Croft Manor. You are required to immediately vacate and surrender possession of said manor to Atlas de Mornay, executor of estates. Lara, it is unfortunate that you have forced my hand in this matter, but so be it. As you know, your parents appointed me executor of the estate in the event of their absence. Since your mother disappeared, her death was never technically declared. And given the circumstances surrounding your father's death, it's no surprise that he never drafted a formal last will and testament to account for this circumstance. Unfortunately, you have no legal claims to the estate. I'm willing to negotiate a modest monthly stipend from your trust, but only if you leave the manor by week's end. Don't fight me on this, love. Your mother wouldn't want that. Sincerely, Atlas. There has to be a will or some kind of evidence of what happened to Mum in the manor somewhere. Dad's safe. Hmm, needs a combination. It's got to be in Dad's papers somewhere. Maybe in the library. My birthday crown. <laughs> I was so proud of that thing. <laughs> That's my handwriting. My penmanship was pretty good. Well, this is a hell of a thing. I met someone tonight quite... My parents made a good team, challenging each other from the start. Dad would have liked me to go to Oxford, but I insisted on UCL. <laughs> yep, looks real. Roth once offered to forge me a fake diploma to show Dad. A picture with Dad and Anna. Never liked wearing dresses, but the color was nice. This is probably my grandfather, Benjamin. I finally introduced Richard to the family. It must have been hard for Mum to go against her family's wishes. I'm glad she did. Dad's map of the forgotten cities of northern Syria. He was closer than he knew to finding the Prophet's tomb. Dad's book about immortality myths might be useful in my research. Dad's Yoruba masks, a gift from a friend he met on an expedition in Nigeria. The door to the library. Locked. Hmm. There's got to be another way through. This is the map I made for my first expedition with Dad. It shows a path to the library through the servants' passages. Dad's artifacts from the Nile Valley. I always loved looking at these. Dad became interested in immortality myths after his expeditions to Egypt. Wait, I can get to the library through the old servant's corridor. Too dark. Going to need a flashlight. Hi, Dad. I've been...
Lara, I've reviewed the report from... <laughs> well, hello there, Sir Lancelot. Don't worry, I won't be boring your sword this time. The Grand Hall. Always loved playing in here as a kid. This will be one of the first things to fix. A phoenix figurine. I bet this appealed to Dad's idea of immortality, of rising from the ashes and being born anew. Lara, you know the West Wing is off limits. I'm sorry, I, I just wanted to see. We've been through this. Was Mum's room in here? Just stay Fuck. out of there. Need a key to open this. Dad was always so protective of the West Wing. What are you doing sitting there on the floor, Mistress Lara? Looking at the compass, thinking. What about, if I may inquire? Just thinking about discovering faraway places, about finding adventure. <laughs> I'm sure you will, my lady. You've the soul of an explorer, but don't grow up too fast. Hmm, not sure. I really need to brush up on my ancestors one of these days. The offer came in the post last week, and I still haven't told Rit. Another one of Dad's immortality artifacts. I think Roth bought this for him from a trader in Greece. Remember to pack this for my next trip. Should be able to explore the dark now. Hey, Jonah. Sorry for not getting back. Amelia, the news has reached Mother. <sighs> Falling apart. Maybe I should just let my uncle have this place. They say a good test of a relationship is... I'm not surprised he asked her to marry him as soon as he got the idea. Amelia, I know we have had our different... Just as creepy as I remember. My lord, I hope this missive finds you on a successful expedition and in... Poor Winston. I remember being so angry. He was always so patient with me.
King to Queen One. I'm going to win this time, Winston. <laughs> Clever girl. But you should know by now, winning isn't everything. Queen to King's Bishop Six. Check. I would play chess with our old butler, Winston, on this board. Never could beat him. I always chose white. Maybe if I let him go first once in a while, I might have won. You to say, you always win. Knight takes queen. What I mean to say is try to enjoy the journey, Lara. Don't rush to victory. Bishop to King Seven. I'm at a crossroads now. Good Lord, that's such a cliche. Everything is almost ready for Mistress La- Loved a good bottle of wine. Hmm. I can still smell his favorite Bordeaux. Dad, this is it! The basement of despair! Indeed, Lara. Muster your courage, for this is the only path to the Library of Infinite Knowledge. Look there! See the string? An ancient Egyptian tripwire. The keepers of knowledge want none to disturb their treasures. We must tread carefully. Let me lead. I know how to spot all the traps. I'm sure you do, my darling. Lead on! <laughs> my stuffed bear. I couldn't have a tomb without a mummy. One of the wire traps Winston made for my birthday expedition. <laughs> Winston used my hair ribbons to make this. He and Dad put a lot of work into this birthday surprise. Hmm, water damage from the main hall above. Bust of Anubis was from Dad's Egyptian collection. He must have put it down in the basement for our little expedition. to the manor. Dad used to say his granny hated all the bright lights. Hmm, there's a missing page. Amelia left tonight. She packed her suit. Okay, Dad's ledger has to be in here somewhere. Hopefully it has the combination to the safe. I've created a clever little map for Lara's book. One of Winston's notes. He always hid sweets for me to find.
I remember this now. Each district in ancient Egypt had a symbol and a number. I always preferred these symbols to the actual number hieroglyphs. Now, let me see, let me see. These two myths are referencing the same source material. This was always one of my favorite books in this library. I used to trace hieroglyphs. I see this image. Dad, I think it's this one, in the chapter on Egyptian districts. Yes, I think you're right, Lara. I remember the page with the illustration of Ra. My goodness, you've been paying attention, haven't you? This could be an important breakthrough. Does this mean I'm your research assistant? That and more, my darling girl. Takes me back. Those were good times. The best times. This picture was taken in the library. 1820 additions to the main hall in progress. Hmm. I've reached the monastery. And hmm. Dad was looking for an elixir. Was it the elixir of life? This is my handiwork. I used to love drawing pictures of tigers. Spent so many hours in here, reading, dreaming of my own adventures. For God's sake, memorize the combination you're... Okay, got to find those objects to figure out the combination to the safe. There's something else here. Dad's lighter. I don't remember him ever using it, though. The Croft family crest and initials BC. I wonder if this belonged to my grandfather. Okay, should be able to light the fireplace now. I always accepted that Richard's rather... This music is familiar. It's beautiful. <laughs> it appears Sir Reginald's helmet fell off. Or oh, didn't I put it back properly? off of this old thing when I was a girl. Still feel it in the shoulder from time to time. of a key. I remember this map now. It leads to the master key. But we made it with a special kind of invisible ink. It could only be seen with the heat of a fire. Hmm. I think I stashed one of Winston's master keys in here when I was a kid. Should help me read the map. I can see the map. 
Looks like the key is hidden under a trunk near the bookcase. X marks the spot, as they say. The master key. This should get me into the West Wing. All right, this should open most rooms in the manor, including the Forbidden West Wing. <laughs> the Pharaoh's crown from my birthday treasure hunt. How old was I again? Six, eight? Hmm, I think this hieroglyph corresponds to a number, but which one? Okay, Dad's clues mention Mum's paintings and their anniversary. Hopefully I can find some answers in the West Wing. Family crest. With Amelia gone, the manor is a different After oh, everything, everything. I think this was Dad's pocket watch. Hmm, looks like it stopped precisely at midnight. Gun, how could you tell him about the expedition? It's just all been too much. I needed to talk to someone. This is Dad. I suppose it's a family tradition, but I can't imagine having one of these made of me. My brother. My mother's perfume, the smell, so familiar, I can almost remember her. <laughs> Mum, on her wedding day, she looks so beautiful. There's a date, October something, damn, the number is faded. Their anniversary was in October, which day? <sighs> I can't believe I don't know this. There's got to be another clue somewhere. I remember this. Dad gave it to Mum on her birthday. October 13th, Mum's birthday. Hmm, pretty sure my parents were married in October. I think it was close to her birthday. I believe it took this trip to push me over the edge. I've been... Mum's wedding ring. I always wondered what happened to it. The inscription is faded. I am bursting with pride. Amelia... Dad may have discovered the secret to immortality without even knowing it.
Amelia would not have approved. At least that old thing still works. I don't trust him. You don't have to, Richard, but please, trust me. I'm sorry, my dear, but I know him. He'll take it to the papers. The investors will pull out. Then go. Without me. Tonight. I will take care of Atlas. And then meet you in Tibet next week. I was so young, but I still remember that terrible argument. It wasn't always an easy road for my parents. My lord, we all hope your work was well received at the conference and look forward to your re- Mum's atelier. Dad sealed it soon after she died. He probably couldn't bear the idea of removing any of her belongings. Untouched for years, exactly as she left it. I stood up to my family's criticism. have any memory of this. I wish I could remember doing this. Mum died too young. Mum with me as a baby. I've never seen this. Hard to believe I was ever that small. Mum's paintings. Which one was Dad's favorite? I returned home this afternoon to collect the last of my painting. Okay, back to the study to open that safe. You've almost got it, darling. Here, let me show you. Like this, see? <laughs> well done, Lara. Well done. I wonder how my life would have been different had she lived. This was for a show in London of Mum's work. What I wouldn't give to see this today. Hmm. It says here, Amelia Croft plans to show her work in New York. I wonder what happened with that. Lara arrived tonight, though not without... I'm glad I still have so much of Mum's work. Dad, what do you keep in there? Nothing too important, Lara. Estate business and such. If it's not important, then why bother putting it in a safe? I should know better than to try and pull one over on you. There is something important in here. And it's for you, should you need it someday. Well, let's hope you came through for me, Dad. Okay, found all the clues. Let's see if I can figure this out. That will help you. It makes me happy to know that Dad kept us safe. No, that's not what I'm looking for. I am numb. It is taking all my will. Dad, what did you do? Dad's sequel to his first book on immortality. He never got a chance to publish it. Handwritten. This is the only copy. Damn, this isn't it either. I was certain there had to be a will in here. 
Wait, what's that? Hmm, a blank page. Dad must have left this for me. It has to be important. Hidden message. What are these strange marks? They have to be some kind of clue. Did this open the secret door from the inside? Hope I'm not trapped in here. Did Dad build all of this just to keep his research safe? It's over. I have done all that I could. You brought her home. She's here, somewhere. This was part of a set of statues Dad found in China. He thought it was linked to the Temple of Xi'an. Perhaps I should look into it someday. Richard, I tried to see you in person last week, but your manservant hustled me away like some common tout peddling silverware. Dad's collected knowledge. There must be so many secrets hidden in here. Might be able to use this to access other parts of the manor. Renovations are proceeding in secret. The work... Amazing. Even in here, Dad went out of his way to hide his findings. Tibetan scroll. I remember he used to pour over this late into the night.
There's an inscription. This is the Croft universe. Our knowledge is to the east. Our respite to the west. Our future is to the south. Our past is to the north. Our past to the north. Could there be something else beneath the manor? Hi, Dad. So I know I only just... I know, Winston. I just want... Oh no! I didn't even see that! You should also know by now, I'm not to be trifled with on this board, young lady. Nate. Lord Croft is resolved to seal... Oh! I am going to win. Someday. is to the south, our past is to the north. expected a sort of crushing finality. My great-grandmother Rose, nicknamed the Golden Rose for her perfect reputation. I wonder what she would have thought of me. My God, can it be? Dad, you did bring her home. My dearest Lara, it is difficult to write this, knowing these may only ever be words on a page to you. You will remember my voice. 
Will you remember the way we used to play and laugh? Will you remember me comforting you when you were sad? Know that I'm still with you, Lara. My energy, my love. It's within you. It always will be. Use that energy to pursue your passions in life. Never let others determine your journey. You become who you are through your choices, through the love you give and the promises you keep. I hope you are happy, that you are loved and successful in whatever it is you choose to do. I am proud of you, my darling. Remember me with all my love, your mother. Lara, I have received the notarized affidavit. I've been so focused on defying my uncle, of fighting to keep his hands off this manor, that I never realized how much this place actually means to me. But since I've been here, I can feel the presence of my mother and father. I sense the entire history of my family and the deep roots we have in this place. I want to honor my parents. I want to honor all of my ancestors. The Croft family may be all but destroyed, but I will make our name and our home great again. broken sword I brought back from Yamatai. The Atlas, such an amazing piece of craftsmanship. Sophia insisted I take it home with me. I can still remember the last time I fired these. 